Hey guys, <clears throat> how are you doing today? Great to see you. Listen, the words the words you use have a tremendous impact on your life. You know, our subconscious mind knows exactly what to get us, how what to get for us, how to get it. Whatever your desires are, it already knows how to bring it in. But there is a problem or there is a situation. The situation is we have to use our own conscious mind to talk to our subconscious mind. And that's the issue that we get. The words we use every single day, and you guys hear this everywhere, they're casting spells. They're making you fortunate. They're making you unfortunate. They're making you successful. They're making you lack. Every day we go out and we talk, we don't understand the power of our language. And this is done on purpose. The power of your language is not something they talk about and they teach you. And a matter of fact, what the Matrix have done, the Matrix have put in, put in our language code words. These code words are like a program or like a glitch in the matrix that will keep the matrix flowing. These code words are designed to make you struggle, to make you poor mentally, physically, to make you sick, to make you not healthy. I am telling you right now, your everyday language you are using is messing you up and it's done on purpose. Listen, read my lips. It is done on purpose. I don't care whatever language you speak, it's all the same meaning. If you speak Japanese, Chinese, Russian, you, ha you all have these words. Isn't it funny? All the languages in the world still have these words, and I'm going and I'm going to get, I'm going to tell you the three code words that you must stop using. I'm, I'm going to give you a bonus code word that one of you just mentioned here. One of the most powerful bonus code word is "I've tried." Mark, I've tried everything you said then you're gonna keep trying, you're not gonna get results. Thank you, Sally. Stop trying. Again, you, you are giving me the example of why it's not working for you. So let me tell you what you're doing wrong, people. And first, I have to, listen, <clears throat> I have to stress the importance that Despite you can do your visualizations, you can use subliminal messages, but I have to I have to remind you that we are active at least 14 hours a day. In our that's when we that's that's called beta state. In the beta state, that's when we affect and manifest our reality the most. That's when we are in our awareness state. So when you are awake 14 hours a day, mostly doing stuff, you are using these words. And these words, you have no idea that they are stopping your manifestation, man. And I just told you, in all the languages, you can whatever language you speak, these words are in your language. You can comment below when I when I reveal these words to you. Go ahead, comment below and say, "Oh, Mark, we don't have this word in our language." Highly unlikely. All of these words are placed in all the languages. Is that a coincidence? I think not. That'll make you think. Why would they place all of these words in all the languages? So, something is connected. What's going on here? Some, the matrix is connected, people. So let me, let's jump into it. Let's t just show you the words that you should never use. You need to stop using them right now. And then I'm going to show you the ones to replace it with, okay? So let me, I wrote them down for you. So you can see them right here. I'll go over them in detail. But you can see the first word is, it's hard. 
Take that out of your vocabulary. The second word is I want slash need. Ooh, that's a tough one. Everybody, it's hard to take that. Listen, hear what I just said. It's hard to take that one out of your vocabulary. See that? Okay. I don't. Okay. Let's break them down. First word, it's hard. Oh, it's hard to make money. It's hard to figure it out. It's hard. It's hard. People use that word every day and they think it's normal. What they don't realize is you are crippling your self-esteem. You are crippling. What else are you crippling, people? You are crippling your possibilities to manifest. You are crippling your belief. You are increasing your doubt. You are creating lack. So, instead of saying it's hard, okay, I'll give, let, let, me, let me make it simple. Let's take two people. And let me, let's get, have two people here, I'm, and I'm going to say to you, one of them I'm going to say, hey, uh, I want you to do this assignment. Um, and you say, two of them says, this assignment is going to be very hard. That's one person. Same assignment. I'm not a person. Hey, I'm going to, I want you to do this assignment. This assignment is going to be very easy. Who's going to come out victorious? Doesn't matter if the assignment is hard. First of all, there's nothing hard. It doesn't exist. <laughs> Got that. So when you say you when you say it's hard, you've already defeated your manifestation. You're, 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 you tell your subconscious mind, hey, this is something I can't do. This is something won't happen. So it's over for now. Let's get it done. Bye-bye. Every day, it's hard. But yet you're manifesting. It's hard. Mark, it's hard. It's hard. I can't do this. Of course you can't do it. Of course it's hard. Because your subconscious is illogical. It's always going to be hard, my friends. It will never get easy. There is, the, there is the word that you should put in. It's easy to be healthy. It's easy to make more money. It is so easy to get what I desire. I create. I have a moment of silence, so you can let that one slip, let that one sink in. Because in the world we live in, my friends, there is no objective world. It's all subjective. That means, if I say it's easy, I am increasing my subconscious for my life to become more easier. If I say it's hard, I am casting a spell and a down on myself. So you need to get that word out. Use the word need. I have to use the word need because that's the next one. I have to put the message to you. The next one is I want slash need. I want that car. I want that health. I want that lifestyle. I want that success. Well, what you're what you're actually doing is you are actually verifying, affirming proven to your subconscious mind that you are in absence of missing something you are lacking something you cannot have something you won't have something and you will not get something point blank so I go back again any languages out there does not have any one of these words in their language nope see all the languages in the world, they put these words in there. See that? It's in your language too. The next one. I don't. I don't have enough. I don't know if I can do it. I don't have it. I don't know. I don't. I don't. Again. I like it. I don't have the motivation. It's not possible. Da 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 da. Replace the word I don't with I have. I know. I know it's possible. I have it. I already have it. You see what I'm saying? You must correct them forevermore. That's right. 
this is have this have to be your new way of speaking it's going to take a little time for you to catch on to this because your brain is so used to it but every time you're aware of it you catch on you change it and listen once you change these words and you put and you start to use the correct form then your life becomes a lot easier and then your manifestations will start to come in what do you replace with want or need you replace with i have and i know i want that no 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 oh i know i can have that i know that is possible for me that's it take out the want because okay let me tell you something you can use those words those words will be fine to use if you didn't have a subconscious mind. But you have a subconscious mind. So you have to be careful with the words. Because the subconscious mind does not work like your conscious mind. Your conscious mind is what people derive and call the smart mind. The smart mind, good. But the smart mind cannot create or manifest anything. The smart mind can only, only ever observe what has been generated by the unconscious part of the mind yeah or I wonder what that would feel like those are the words you have to use and then because your subconscious mind is so illogical when you say I it's hard your subconscious says of course it's hard but it's your subconscious is so illogical that when you say it's easy of course it's so easy see how you look at that have you ever thought of that it's easy to make more money watch how more money comes to you it's easy for the process to work for me watch how easy the process works for you it's easy for me to find love and happiness look how love and happiness comes it's easy for me to, to maintain my health look how easy your health maintain it's hard for me to be consistent but look how hard it's gonna be for you to be consistent it's hard for me to make money consistently watch how hard it's gonna be for you to make money consistently I mean, it's not rocket science. I need more success. I need more money. I want more money. You won't get more money. You won't get more success. I already have more money. I already have more success. I know it's possible to have money and success. Watch how easy and possible all this stuff start coming into your life. I already have it. I can get that. That's already mine. I wonder what that would look like. Look how fast that comes into your mind. I don't have it, I don't think I can do it, I don't think it's possible, and watch how it's not possible, and watch how your life's gonna, not gonna be positive, positive for you. That's, I mean, those are the things and the words that you have to be aware of when you are uh, an awakened being. The majority of the world they don't know this they'll you they, they use these common words every day and they wonder why their life haven't changed because they are, we are the ones that are sinking our own ship there's nobody sinking your ship but you because you're the only captain of the ship right make sense so you have to change the whole structure of your mind man you, you gotta you gotta this is this is like you it's like you wake up one day and you say to yourself and you look and you look around you you get so you get so angry you say man all this time you all got me messed up everything that i thought was correct it was all incorrect now i gotta go out there and i gotta retrain my whole brain because you people messed me up you the matrix the society the religions the stuff my family my, you all messed me up man and they don't tell you they mess you up. They tell you, oh, oh, that's just how it is. That's normal. That's the, that's, listen, that's the way it's supposed to be. It's not, no, people, it's not supposed to be that way. You see, the big, the, the thing that's hidden from you is that the big, the biggest thing they, that's really hidden from all of you is the fact that your life can actually become very easy for you if you want. Your life can become very hard for you if you want. So go into yourself right now and ask yourself, okay, what is my life right now? If your life is easy, congratulations because that's what you wanted. 
If your life is hard or difficult, I have news for you. That's what you wanted. Whoa, wait a minute. No, this guy's crazy. You, I don't want a hard life, man. Why are you telling me I want a hard life? Yes, you want a hard life. What do you mean? Because there's two parts of you that are living in you, man. One part of you may not want a hard life. That's the part you're thinking with. That's the part you're saying. I, I don't want a hard life. That's called your conscious mind, my friends. But I just showed you. Even when you, my, my, your conscious mind says, we don't want a hard life, man. But if you don't want a hard life, then why are you still experiencing a hard life? Right? Something ain't right then. Well, you got a point, man. I don't want a hard life, but I'm still having a hard life. So I just told you, if I repeat it again, if your life is easy, that's what you want. If your life is hard, that's also what you want. Are you catching on now? Still don't get it? Okay, here we go. I have free will. Uh, I don't want a hard life. Okay, you don't want a hard life. So why is your life hard? If you don't want a hard life. Well, what's going on? Well, there's two minds in your head. Your conscious mind doesn't want a hard life. But your subconscious mind wants the hard life. That's the mind that's below your conscious awareness. That's the mind that makes you do what you do every day. It's a 97 program percentage mind. So that means what's going on up here doesn't necessarily matter with what's going on down there. What's going on down there is more important than what's going on up here because what's down there is controlling and making you do your habits and action and that's your world you live in. So now you now you understand what I said. If you want if you're having a hard life, it's because you want a hard life. Well, Mark, how did I how did I make myself want a hard life? Because you were using this mind to program that mind with the words you were using every day. It's hard. I want. I need. I don't. I hope. I try. So you see. That's how they get you. They put these words in your everyday language. So if you want to change it, you got to know the master of the tools and know how to do it. But these are just some steps for you to begin so that you can take the control and master and change it. And if you want to know more and you want to take it to the next level, then here, Got to go get these books, man. Here they go. Amazon paperback. The lottery one is Amazon's bestseller. One of Amazon's bestsellers. The cheat code to master the game of life. Go beyond. This is your manual. And to excel it, to put a system, if you want to really take it, then you can get into my mentoring program. You can sign up for my mentoring program. Pin comments up in it there. So you can go in and learn how to change this stuff. But this is the forefront and this is the start for you guys. Remember, eliminate these words and you will eliminate all the lack and doubt and you will increase your possibilities, you will increase your abundance and your life will definitely get better and better and better. See you again next time.